a very proud principal here at Crossroads South Middle School, and we're so happy you could join us. I told you it was a little warmer in here than it is out there. Um, so a few things. Just uh, I would like to just let you know that BTN, the Viking Television Network, is actually recording tonight. So you know how you worry about having your phone and maybe you have somebody's head in front of you or we don't want to distract people behind us? Viking Television Network is recording and the recording will be on YouTube. So you can go back and watch this concert again and have it for your own memories. Um, we'd like to just remind you that we want to keep our aisles clear. So please take a seat somewhere and make sure that you're seated um, throughout the performance. We will have students walking back and forth um, as they transition between groups. I also want to give a big thank you to Mr. Bester and the Viking Television Network for coming and recording tonight, as well as our custodians for supporting our concert tonight and all of the other people that you will meet along our journey this evening. So relax, put your phones down, enjoy a meeting of music, and we are starting here tonight with Mr. And our concert band students.
getting to be able to come up from the elementary school and work with the uh, middle school is, as I always say, a rewarding feeling because I get to make a connection a little bit more on a, on a higher scale level. And um, I don't get to really do those lyrical pieces all too much with the, the younger folks. And I told this group, playing a slower piece of music and actually at a softer dynamic or softer um, volume, as you used to say, is one of the hardest things to do with a band. And that's something that they really, really worked hard on. Um, and it doesn't happen unless you really have that focus and the energy and also just that calm feeling. So um, I hope that you were able to share that too. Um, now we have to turn it up again. And as far as tempo goes, one of their favorite pieces, Nightbar. One of the first pieces that they had received, um, as, as I said, up tempo and um, definitely gets them moving. Ladies and gentlemen, I won't get to speak to you again, but I hope you enjoy Nighthawk. And once again, it is a pleasure to be in front of you. Um, I know a lot of the students have, have been asking, and some of you may have been asking. They definitely have a well-deserved uh, morning off tomorrow. So for those that have been asking about Contraband and Workplace, yeah. Yeah. director of the Jazz Ensemble here at Crossroads South. Uh, before we get started, I wanted to give one more congratulations to our concert band students. This was their first... This was their first of hopefully many, many concerts and memories on this stage with us here. We're so proud of them and the work that they put in. Uh, it's definitely... You know, diving into this middle school program is a lot, as a sixth grader, a lot to get used to. And they've done a great job getting in here and, and waking up for those early morning rehearsals and practicing all their music. Very proud of you, concert band. Let's give them one more round of applause. So the group you see in front of you tonight is our jazz ensemble. Uh, this is one of two jazz groups we have here at Crossroads South, and uh, if you're a parent, I'm sure you already know this, of the jazz ensemble and jazz band members. Uh, if you're not, these students that are in the jazz groups here are waking up every single morning before school to be here to rehearse, because they have two days a week of their regular band class that they're in, 
and then three days a week of jazz. So they are they are early risers and hard workers, and we're very, very excited to be on the stage with you here tonight. Uh, of all nights, this is the night my voice has decided to go, so I'm not going to talk too much. Uh, we're going to let them play, and once you hear them play, you're not going to want to hear from me anyway. So uh, our first piece is a jazz classic, Autumn Leaves. Hope you enjoy it. This is a folk rock classic known as The Chicken. Uh, this one is going to feature three soloists. It's going to feature Jung Hong on the alto, Jaden on the trumpet, and Atish on the alto. Uh, they have a band play on uh, In case you've never been to a jazz performance, uh, unlike concert band, if you were at a concert band or a wind ensemble performance, you would not clap for the soloist until the end of the piece. In a jazz format, you actually clap in the middle of the piece as soon as the solo is finished. So feel free to let them know how you think they play. Uh, they definitely appreciate hearing from you. This is the chicken.
We'll give them a minute to, to rotate. They sometimes look like chickens when they do this, but uh, the reason they're, they're rotating around is they each get a chance to play some of the higher or lower parts in the band to develop their different strengths. Uh, so it takes a minute, but allows them each to get a different opportunity for each of these songs. Um, our third and final piece is basically the blues. A little pun there. Uh, Count Basie was a famous band leader, actually from New Jersey, uh, the Red Bank area. Um, and this piece is modeled after some of his, his compositions. We have two solos in, in this one. We have Anch on the tenor sax. We have Tage on the drum set. We hope you enjoy.
Thank you very much. Um, it would be a mistake right now for us not to share with you all of the thanks we need to give to a lot of people to help make this work. Uh, from up at the board office, the support we get up there, transportation department, getting all these kids in in the morning, uh, to down here, our level, I'm oh, sorry, I forgot there, Board of Education will help support the, the music programs um, in, the, in the township, but then coming down to our school. So we, we have not only uh, the custodians helping keep the, the facility functioning, but we also have some great people that help us out as far as morning drop off. Anybody in the front of the building, when you're dropping <coughs> off your child in the front of the building, we have Miss Newton and Mr. Michaels here helping us out tonight. Woo! So big round of applause. Morgan, who came out tonight to help us out as a chaperone. We couldn't do the great things that we're able to do here without a, a really supportive administration from the school. So we'd like to thank Ms. Hinson, who's here tonight, Mr. Kimmick, who's been here with us tonight, and also Mr. Thank you. 
students progress through the music program, how, um, how incredibly talented these kids are. This is not easy music by any stretch. The things that they're trying to do here are so complex. Um, and they really do it with ease. I say every year that they they should be out for hire for parties and things like that. Um, they would be lovely. But I want to give a huge round of applause to all of our students who <laughs> are Thank you. 